Welcome! As a music collector, there's certain points in a year that's just so exciting, it's better than Christmas Day. And for me, and I think for pretty much any other music collector really, of a particular artist, it's when one of your favourite artists releases a new album. And I'm delighted to have in my hand right here the brand new studio album from one of my favourite artists. Only really started getting into him last year, although I had heard bits and bobs of his work many years previously, but started collecting him last year. I've got all of his albums on record that um, have come out. I've got, I think, most, if not all, of his singles that have come out on 7-inch as well. And this has come all the way from America. It has got some British sort of Royal Mail stickers on, but I think there was like some sort of redirection thing going on. I just can't wait to get this open. As soon as I saw that it had been dispatched, its official release date was early July. So it coming from America and from his record label, I just couldn't wait for this day. And um, I love this guy's music so much. Um, you're probably going to know who it is, judging by the intro and what's playing in the background. But um, let's go through the motions nonetheless. This should be relatively easy to open as we've got one of these pull apart tabs, although it's quite a hefty one that's just tearing in my hand. This was off Bandcamp, by the way, as is most of the music, the albums and singles that I've bought by this artist has been on Bandcamp. There's been a bit on Discogs as well, and perhaps uh, one of his albums I picked up on eBay, I can't remember now. All those videos will be in my music collecting playlist. Really struggling with this record mailer here, ah, I think we're in there. Ha <laughs> ha awesome. Oh, what have we got here? Oh, we've got 100% um, Electronica sticker. Very nice. That's the record label. I think this is the first time this artist has released on this label. It's just a small independent label over in the States. I think based out of New York somewhere. We've also got a picture plane. Yes, that's who it is. I don't know why I'm sort of leaving it as a surprise. Probably even said who it is in the video title. But a picture plane business card there. Could be another sticker. This side feels quite glossy. I mean, it's not really a business card because it doesn't have any information on it. It's just picture plane. So a couple of nice extras there. I think that's it for the extras themselves. But here is... Oh, I've so, so been looking forward to this ever since I knew it was coming out. Dopamine by Picture Plane, his brand new studio album. <laughs> Now, um, anyone who's heard my intro theme will be familiar with track one on here. My favourite single of 2020, Avalanche. How long I'm able to use that music for, for my intro, until the copyright Gestapo comes knocking. I'm not sure, but um, it's been a good run if I have to stop using it soon. Like I say, it's on the 100% Electronica label. I think his last two or three albums have come out on his own label, but um, he's obviously working with... A separate record label this time but same sort of picture playing style this very sort of bold quite simple text here having pre-ordered it and then paid for it on Bandcamp I have been able to listen to the album digitally for quite some time now since like it came out start of July I've listened to a bit of a couple of other tracks which sound fantastic but I've deliberately not played the whole album digitally yet because I just wanted to get it on the record player as soon as it came I am going to open it because this should be a very fancy disc to show you. Don't need to worry about tearing this cellophane off here because there's no hype sticker to preserve. We've got in here. So we've got one of these nice inserts here with um, some credits and production notes and stuff. I think that's lyrics there on that side. So this has come out in a few formats. I think it's come out on cassette, come out on CD, it's certainly come out digitally. And I think there's been two vinyl record formats, both coloured, both non-black. 
one of them was announced like some time after this one that I pre-ordered. I didn't really care which one I got. This one's gonna look absolutely amazing anyway. So it's got a plain inner sleeve there. And then, ah, oh, <laughs> check that out. So let me put this down so I can show you properly. Wow. Being careful here. But blue and purple spatter effect. Awesome. I think the other colour variant is like a red one that's also got sort of maybe bits of blue spatter in it. Wow. Oh, yes. The new Picture Plane album. My favourite artist of the last, well, year and a half, nearly two years, to be honest. Absolutely marvellous. And there we have it. Witch House pioneer, Witch House inventor, you could say, Picture Plane. His brand new album on coloured vinyl dopamine absolutely brilliant artist i say it every time i do a picture plane related video but go on bandcamp you can listen to all his stuff for free check him out and a lot of his stuff is also on youtube and spotify and all the rest as well so plenty of places to listen to him and it won't cost you a penny me i like collecting his stuff i like physical music media and um, especially when it comes in such a cool format as a blue and purple or blue and pink spatter LP or whatever this is. I don't really care what the description is. It just looks cool and I know it's gonna sound even better. So thank you to Picture Plane's record label, 100% Electronica, for sending this out safely all the way from the United States. It's not taken too long to get here, a couple of weeks or so. Fairly decent price for a new release on Bandcamp, including international postage can't really complain about that either thank you to all of you for watching special thanks go as always to my subscribers and generous gorgeous patrons please see all my usual links including my patreon link down in the description text box i'm gonna go now and duh what else put dopamine on been waiting to listen to this for over a year because I knew this was coming out as soon as Avalanche was released and that was about a year ago maybe even a bit over and it's taken a while with certain circumstances the world pandemic and everything and picture plane I think had to delay release of this for a little while but it's here it's out now I've got my copy and I am absolutely over the moon and I do hope that all of you will join me again next time for my next music collecting and record unboxing video. Cheers, everyone. See ya!